Nonviolence should never be used as a shield for cowardice. It is a weapon of the brave. Gandhi, that's from Mahatma, Volume 7. I have an unusual reflection to share on this very central plank of Gandhi's platform. There's a scene in one of Dostoevsky's novels in which uh, a prince, Prince Mishkin, I believe, comes back to his estate, having been away at the wars, and shockingly, a peasant slaps him. Uh, I won't go into the backstory of how he had offended that peasant, but normally, a noble would just, you know, take out his sword or something and dispatch someone who had such audacity, but Mishkin simply stands there shaking like a leaf, obviously controlling his anger. And that seemed to me, although when I first read it, I had not read Gandhi very much, but that seemed to me an unusual kind of courage. And I think that's what nonviolence is. It's an unusual kind of courage. Courage of people who do not run away, but who do not strike back. <laughs> 